Ah, good day, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Cute Craft. <laughs> my favorite series on my channel right now, if you're good at tell. Um, so, anyways, last episode, we made a lovely little hobbit hole down there, or I should say hobbit holes for our cows, pigs, sheep, and... Well, that's it. Cows, pigs, and sheep, because... We needed some sheeple uh, so we could make some sheep armor. And we also had to make them in an encased area because <laughs> as you guys can probably remember, RIP to my animals that were once over here. Bad. Uh, but they are nice and protected in this cute little hobbit hole. And uh, that is that because, uh, like I said, we had to make the, the sheep armor so I could go. Even though that makes me really sad because Cyclops are like one of my favorite mythical creatures. Uh, mostly because of Leela in uh, uh, Futurama. She's one of my favorite freaking characters. So, um, anyways, I guess without further ado, let's go head on off and try and kill the damn guy. So during my move, I had to get a new computer. And with that, I don't have any of my old waypoints. So we're going to have to go figure out where the Cyclops is on our own. Let's see if we have our book. We do. Let's just um, double check and make sure we know everything about our Cyclops. Okay. Cyclopses are very vigilant creatures, able to see potential prey and threats from afar. So he has like kind of an intense vision with his one big eye. So I don't know if we should take an arrow, but I feel like with this, another way to avoid the Cyclops gaze would be to disguise oneself as a sheep. So I feel like we could easily do that one, but I do also want to shoot him in the eyeball. So it's kind of mean, but you know what? Let's go get a bow and arrow. We'll make some bows and then we will head off on our quest. Come on, Pegasaurus. Let's go over to our home. Home sweet homo. Okay, I don't know if I have a bow already made. I probably don't. Well, yes, I do. It's right here. Duh. Okay, so I just need bows. I mean arrows. <laughs> no storm. Oh, duh. I also need feathers. Oh, I'm so stupid. I have so many feathers. Oh, good. I have a ton of feathers. Woohoo! Almost a full stack of arrows. We are good to go. Okay, let's hop on Pegasaurus. And let's head to where we once saw a Cyclops. I don't remember how far away it was, but I know the direction. And it was this way. Yippee! On another quest! Figure that stuff out on this computer. But don't worry, guys. Questcraft is coming back. It's just been a struggle with the move. But I promise you, it'll be back and better than ever. <gasps> Hi, Miss Fairy. I bet you want to steal something from me. Well, guess what? You're not going to. Ha ha. Chop your little wings off if I have to. Oh my gosh, guys. I found a desert temple. Now, I don't know if it's already been compromised, but let's go hop in and see for ourselves. Hello, desert temple. Have you been compromised? <gasps> you sure have. I wonder if I compromised it. You know what? Oh, well, we looked. We tried. What a waste. I'm pissed off. Ugh. Get out of that cactus. Pegasaurus. Oh, sweet chap. Um, I think I'm getting a little lost. I don't really remember exactly where the Cyclops was. I thought it was this direction, but um, I've been traveling for quite some time, and I haven't run into the, the seahorses, which were nearby, or, you know the things whatever they're called yeah so um we might just have to find a new cyclops home <laughs> guys 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 i found it i found it i freaking found it i found it again oh my gosh there it is <gasps> wow. oh wow 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 <gasps> is he inside there yes he is i think i hope I don't know. I don't see anything in there. I hope no one else went in there and like scooped it up before I could. Okay. So Pegasaurus, you're going to wait here and I'm going to go head over to this crazy place. 
Um, I think I might need blocks, so let's trim these so we can climb on up there. <gasps> I'm nervous. I'm nervous. I'm nervionious. But you know what? Let's stake it out. Are those Cyclopses in there? <gasps> wow, there he is. Oh, wow. He's big. He's big. All right, Pegasaurus, you stay safe. Oh, my gosh. Hello. Hi. Hi, sir. Hi. So lovely to meet. Wow, that's a what a big eye you have. Do you know Leela? You don't. Okay. Um. Well then, let's just make a little cute staircase like this. Nope. Hi. Hello, sir. What a gorgeous eye you have. Look, I'm just a simple sheep. Bah! Look at me. I'm a little sheep. Bah! Oh, he's so... <gasps> Uh-oh. Hi. What's your name? He looks like a big old baby. Oh, my gosh. Okay, he seems nice. Hi. What are you standing on? Are you trapped in there? <gasps> I think you might be trapped. Hi, sir. Um, I'm just gonna look and see what's inside one of these chests, if you don't mind. <gasps> wool, that's a lot of wool you have there. Thank you so much. That's very kind of you. Um, I will be a little upset, uh, if that's all you have in here. But, oh my gosh! You only got wheat? I mean, not wheat. Sheep wheat? And sheep wool? And meat? Damn you! Why? I came all this way for this! Oh, just kidding. Okay, you got something good. Bottle of enchanting. Take those cobwebs. Um, sir. Hi, uh, yes. Um, out of pure frustration of the fact that you didn't really have anything good or worth my while, um, I think I'm gonna have to kill you now. First, I'm gonna take your big ol' eye out. Hey! He's like, who did that? Was it the sheep? Hi, huh, sir. <gasps> Let me shoot your eyeball. I want to shoot it. Hi. Hello. Where's your hearts? Do you have any heart shards? Oh! Oh my gosh! He bit my face off. He bit my freaking face off. Oh. My gosh, that was terrifying. Okay, well then, um, that was a thing. Where is this my last death? Oh, okay. Hi, it's just me. Um, can I blind you? Blind your eyeball. Oh! Oh, he's mad. He doesn't like that. He says, don't you touch my eyeball like that. I did it. I did it. I did it. Ha ha. Ha ha, loser. You'll never get me now. I'm the gingerbread man. Ha 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 ha. Death be with you. No, death be with you. Death be with you. Oh, 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 he killed me again. You're blind. How did he see me? Uh, oh, that's not the right one. Oh, what did he drop? What did he drop? Leather. That's all? That's all you dropped, sir? Oh my gosh. I'm not okay with this. That was rude and disrespectful if I've ever seen anything rude and disrespectful. Let's see what the book says about what he should be dropping. Because I came all this way. I did all that work last episode for what? You tell me. Okay. Wearing the full set of armor and sneaking makes one practically invisible to the Cyclops. All the precautions should be taken when dealing with such a strong creature as one bite from a cyclops is enough to decapitate. Yep, learn that. Maybe there's more pages to this. Oh, here's where it's said about the treasure. Most cyclopses make their homes from dugout sea coves on the shore. Inside these coves lay both remnants of cyclops last meals and significant treasures. Significant treasures, my ass. What's so significant about freaking meat I'll tell you what nothing but I will take the bone blocks because I don't know what they're used for but maybe I can get bones out of them and who knows if those will come in handy or not 
<sighs> I came all this way and I have to get back on Pegasaurus and fly all the way freaking home. Must be nice to be carried all the way. Pegasaurus better still be over there or else I'm suing. Peggy Lynn, it's time to go home. Where are you, Peggy Lynn? Oh, there she is. She is beauty. She is great. She's Miss Peggy Lynn. I kind of want to fly around the seashore to see if there's any more Cyclops homes. You know, now that we know what to expect, maybe we'll find some other friends. She sells seashells down by the seashore. Stay away! Oh my gosh, this bird thing is trying to attack Pegasaurus. Let's kill her. We'll show her a lesson or two. Stay. Oh, I shot myself. Oh, oh, I shot myself again. You stay back. Ow! Oh my god, I can't risk this. I can't risk this bird and Pegasaurus. I'm sorry. Pegasaurus, we have to retreat. That nasty bird won't leave us alone. Why are you still following us? Why are you mean? You're a bully. That's what bullies do. We outran him, Pegasaurus. Because we're skinny legends. That's why. He just couldn't keep up. Can you keep up? The heck is this? So I'm on the way home, and I've come across the most magical place. It it seems like this is built? Why are there all these torches? Oh, it's Shovel's house. I was so confused for a second. This is so cute and magical. What are these things? Oh, it's an oak trap door. Wow, she made it so mystical. You need to tame it down because this is so adorable. And look at I just realized this was a dragon's head. What the heck? That goes to the nether. And that goes to the either. Oh, I understand. Damn, she's creative. I hate that girl. Gosh, so annoying. Why are you so good? Look at all this cute brush. Just makes me want to work harder on mine. Because I still have a lot of things that I want to do. And I'm not done yet. So, yeah, take that. Anyways, we're back home now. From our crazy adventure of killing those Cyclops, let's add another book, book page to our bestiary book. Ooh, what's it gonna be? What's our next adventure gonna be? Also, I'm putting on better armor because that sheep stuff did not protect me against that Cyclops one bit. Okay, let's see, let's see. What do we got? Um, oh, oh, what did we, what did, what was added? What was added? Uh, was it the ice dragon? It might have been. The legends are true. Such beasts such as the one this entry focuses on do exist. Wait, I'm, I don't know how to read. How many pages are there? Oh, this is a lot to read right now. You know what? When we want to deal with the ice dragon, we will deal with the ice dragon. Um, because I still do want a baby dragon ice egg. Um, oh, I completely forgot I had that egg. But we don't know how to do those eggs yet. Oh, wait. Ice dragon eggs. The eggs. Oh, that's why. Okay. So we can't do the green egg because I don't know how to hatch it. But since I do know how to get the ice dragon. Okay. I think next episode, we definitely need to focus on the ice dragons. And try and find an ice dragon egg because I want to hatch one and have my own little baby. But anyways, I guess that's it for today's episode. If you guys enjoyed it, please give it a big old thumbs up. and lets me know you're enjoying my cute craft series. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today. I love you. I will see you all tomorrow. Tomorrow. I love you. I love you. Goodbye.